Today on What's Hot on the Car Lot with Davey, I have a brand new 2022 Toyota Prius all-wheel drive nightshade edition. And what I'm going to do today is do a walk around of the vehicle. So the first thing I will do is give you a close up of the window sticker so you know what's going to be on the vehicle. One of the big reasons a lot of people buy Toyota Prius vehicles is this reason right here. Great fuel economy with 51 city and 47 highway as far as miles per gallon goes. And I'm going to do an outside and inside walk around. Uh, the vehicle does have the 15 inch black wheels on it and as Toyota Priuses they are all hybrid vehicles which is another reason why they get great gas mileage and I work at a Toyota dealership in West Virginia and I am near a tri-state area so we do sell vehicles in the West Virginia Ohio and Pennsylvania areas and also would like to take the time to ask if you could if you end up liking the video if you could please subscribe and like the channel I would very much appreciate that the more people who subscribe to the channel the more content that I'm going to put on this channel in the future and being a new Toyota dealership I plan on putting more Toyota vehicles on my page and whenever we get a pretty good pre-owned vehicle i'll put that on there as well and while i'm back here i might as well give you a look at the trunk now this is the trunk area of the prius and this vehicle does have the all-weather floor liners on it it also comes with a cargo net it looks like And I'll go over one safety feature of the vehicle before I hop in and go over some of the inside features. Uh, one of the nice safety features of the vehicle is the blind spot monitoring. So these two little cars will turn orange whenever anybody is getting ready to pass you. So for example, you're on the interstate, somebody's getting ready to pass you, those two little cars will turn orange. All right, so let me give you an idea of what the inside of the vehicle looks like. So the inside is going to have the black soft tech leather seats and they are heated seats as well. And give you a look at the second row of seating as well. All right, now that we got a good look at that, I'm going to hop into the Toyota Prius and go over some of the features once we get this turned on. Something else that's pretty cool on this Toyota Prius is it does have keyless entry in it. So as long as you have the key somewhere on you, uh, in your pocket, possibly in your purse. All you have to do is have the key on you and the vehicle will automatically unlock for you. All right, now we're in the vehicle, we will turn it on. All you gotta do is hit the brake and hit this power button with the key somewhere in the vehicle. And the vehicle will turn on. And you'll know the vehicle's on because it says ready. Toyota Priuses are very quiet when they first start up. So it's nice that it does read ready and green to let you know that the vehicle is on. Now while I'm in the vehicle, I'm going to go over some of the features of it while we're in here. Uh, first thing you'll notice is the 7 inch touchscreen that is on the vehicle. 
and you can go into the different settings on the touch screen uh, mostly through the menu setting and when you go to the menu you'll see things such as audio which is going to be good for your radio um, phone which you can set up your phone by turning your bluetooth on uh, an apps option projection which the projection will turn into apple carplay or android auto by basically hooking your phone up to the USB port so you can actually get navigation through the Apple CarPlay Android Auto with any of our Toyota vehicles. A little info button that will give you more information about the Prius and then the setup button will give you all your general settings on the vehicle such as language, customized home screen, and anything you might want to change background wise you can do through this setting. Also if you want to get into your Bluetooth or check out your radio from this setting or even do the voice recognition mode you can change some things up in the setup screen here uh, right below that you'll have your climate controls which they make it pretty user friendly on this Toyota Prius so basically your temperature is going to be right here uh, your fan is going to be right next to it so you can adjust the fan up and down as you prefer And then next, uh, the Toyota Prius uh, transmission is right here. Uh, pretty standard to previous years of the Toyota Prius. And while we're here, we'll check out the backup camera. So that gives you an idea of what the backup camera will look like. And we'll put it back in park. Uh, the vehicle does have a couple of different drive modes. Which by pressing that button, it'll show up right here what mode you put it in. So we're in eco mode now. That would be normal by pressing the button once again. It has a power mode. And back to normal. So it has normal, eco, and power as far as the drive modes on the vehicle. It does have a place where you can wirelessly charge your Android phone or your iPhone. And this is where the heated seats are on the vehicle as well. As we mentioned previously, this vehicle does have heated seats for the front too. You have your cup holders. You have your middle console for storage. And it also has a couple settings over here for parking assist and this vehicle does also have the heated steering wheel which is this button right here now a couple other things on the steering wheel itself you can uh, change the radio volume you have your trip button if you want to see how many miles you're going on your next trip so you do have different settings on there as well And then through using the arrow buttons right here, it will control all your different settings that will actually appear right up here. If you start hitting the arrow button, which I'm doing right now, it will take you through the different settings on the steering wheel. Uh, probably the most important one to kind of go over with you is the very end, as this is going to tell you pretty much all the different safety features you have on the vehicle, such as the lane assist, uh, lane assist steering mode so this gives you an option for all your safety features uh, pre-collision system having it on or off and you can change all of these settings to on or off uh, we recommend you keeping all the safety settings on but you do have the option to change them as you like and then you can set the sensitivity of these features as well this deals with your parking assist Line spot monitoring, which I went over before I got in the vehicle with you. And a lane sway warning as well. You can turn that on or off. But pretty much all your safety features will be on the very end. All right, now that I went over uh, the different inside and outside features of the vehicle, I think this is where I'm going to wrap up the video for today. Once again, if you do like the video, I would appreciate it if you could subscribe and like the What's Hot on the Car Lot with Davey channel. 
as that will make me give you more future content on the Toyota vehicles we get and sometimes some of the other uh, pre-owned vehicles we get on a lot that might be a little bit rarer I'll typically put on my YouTube channel as well uh, once again thank you for watching and have a good rest of your day